We are dishing on movies. This week we're gonna do some little retro action. A little retro. <laughs> we're going Goonie style on Oldie you guys. but goody. Almost 30 years ago. Which I can't believe it means we're really old. I don't wanna talk about <laughs> it. Um, so we're gonna be making some delicious baby Ruth. So easy, so let's hop right to it. Homemade Baby Ruth candy bars take only 11 ingredients. One quarter cup of whole milk, a tablespoon of peanut butter, 26 unwrapped caramels, corn syrup, one teaspoon of unsalted butter, one quarter teaspoon of vanilla extract, one eighth teaspoon of salt, three quarters cup of powdered sugar, an additional one half cup of powdered sugar, and 12 ounces of milk chocolate chips. Hey, you guys! What are you doing? Get over here and let's get cooking. Just working on the form. First of all, we're going to take some pre-made caramels, six. Not four, not eight, six. To that, we're going to add a teaspoon of butter, a pinch of salt. Let's see, we're going to add um, about a tablespoon of a light corn syrup. A tablespoon of just smooth, regular old peanut butter. And that's it. We're going to bring this to uh, a smooth consistency over the heat. We're melting this caramel until it's nice and smooth. I'm going to go ahead and add the milk just until it's incorporated. So we're cooking this caramel and mix her down until it's nice and smooth. And now we're going to have Dale add the powdered sugar. I'll put this away, you start stirring. Oh, okay. Lefty twist. We want it to get pretty thick. We're looking for 230 degrees with a candy thermometer. That's hot. It is. It's above boiling. Oh. So we're going to bring bringing this to a boil. That really is hot. So now this is at 220 degrees. Now it's time to quickly remove from heat and add our powdered sugar to make our nougat. Go ahead and add that. And then we're going to mix. Is it ready yet? Sure. This is ready. So see how it's so thick? Mm -hmm. This is perfect. We're going to go ahead and stop mixing now. And we're going to let it sit aside for about 10 minutes just until it's cool to the touch so we can start to roll it like a Tootsie Roll almost. Mm. This is going to be the center of our baby. So is this what nougat is always? or? Uh, there's various uh, recipes for nougat, but this is the one that we're going to do that's very similar to that candy bar. Uh -huh. And see how it's so sticky? It's like a booty trap. Oh. Uh, did you say booty trap? I think you mean booby trap. That's what I said, booty trap. Alright. Booty trap. Booby. Booby trap. That's what I said. <laughs> so we're gonna start to roll these nougats. So we're gonna take about a teaspoon. You see how thick it got? It's about a teaspoon there. It looks good already. And we're just gonna use our hands and roll them to about four inches. Here's the thing, it doesn't have to be perfect. This is our own homemade little guy. We have this on parchment lined paper so that they're easily taken off. I'll take off into my mouth. Mine's weirder than yours. That's Any okay. More? It's okay. The beauty of this is they're all homemade. We call that rustic. Oh, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> That's just southern for ugly. What better story? You know, kids are struggling, overdevelopment. They have an opportunity to save their talent by finding the secret buried treasure, I mean. It's true. Baby Ruth saved his life. Baby Ruth did save his life. I don't know if I would be Sloth's friend right away either. Uh, he was a weird looking dude. You know what? I think I dated a guy that looked like Sloth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's amazing when you're in a bar that's dark uh, <laughs> after a couple of cocktails and uh, you get outside to the moonlight. Uh -huh. You got a sloth on your hands. At this point, we want these to get hard so that we can actually handle them and roll them. If you look at them, they've already started to spread. Yep. So we need to get them really hard. So you can let them sit out on the counter for an hour to two hours so they firm up, or pop it in the freezer for about 20 to 30 minutes. So we're gonna go the easy way and pop them in the freezer. Freeze it up. The next step is to take our caramel squares, 20, and melt them with one and a teaspoon of water. So 
This takes a while, so be patient. This smells good. I'm hungry. <laughs> I am hungry though. So this caramel or caramel is deliciously melted and ready to be poured. Perfection. Okay, cool. So we've got everything that we need right here. We've got our nougats, we have our nuts, and we have our caramel. We're just gonna take the brush, pick up one of our nougats, okay, and just brush it with caramel. Be careful, guys. This is really, really hot. And this is gonna be the glue that keeps our caramel, our nuts, rather, <laughs> stuck to the nougat. But this is hot, so be careful. Okay, and while it's in the caramel, and the nuts, rather. I'm gonna put even more on here. Yum. I'm using dry roasted, dry roasted uh, nuts. So, but you could use either? Um, you can use salted if you want, absolutely. I like a little little salty sweet combo, you know. All right. So that's gonna be one of our little guys. Hey, it's a payday. Now, if you're making the candy and you find that the caramel got a little hard, you can go ahead and reheat it. Look at that. Oh, that's nutty. nutty. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we have rolled and condensed them a little bit. To make sure they stay together, we're gonna pop these bad babies in the freezer. Through the magic of YouTube, it's now been 20 minutes. So let's pull these things out. About to be your baby root daddy. In she goes. Oh. Roll it around. Man, that looks good. You could cover anything in chocolate though, and I'd probably be obsessed with it. I might grab it let it drain off. And that's fine. Go ahead and put it on the paper now. So we'll keep doing this until we have them all done. All right, they are chocolateified. Chocolate. And they're gonna go into the freezer. I guess he didn't say everything like that, but. <laughs> <laughs> so we're gonna have them in there for what do you say, 20, 30 minutes? Oh no, more like five to 10 minutes. Yeah, like five to 10 minutes, obviously. All right, they're done. Looks so good. Voila. These homey baby rooms with milk chocolate and semi-sweet chocolate are just ready to be eaten. What, so? I mean, shall let's we? Let's do it then. Sir? Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. <laughs> oh my God, so good. Oh my God. The nuts, the caramel, the nougat. Mm. Oh, it's making me use a truffle shuffle. Mm, 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 mm. Oh my god, it's mm, so good. Mm. Say hello, Krista. Oh, I love you too. Mm. Try them out. Hope you guys enjoy. Mmm. Mm. some good. You're enjoying. Baby root. Mm. My mouth got that stuff closed though. We are dishing <laughs> our movies.